15 types of cranes used in construction For different types of lifting jobs on construction sites, there are different types of cranes each having its own pros and cons and are specific for certain jobs. So in our today's amazing video, we'll be discussing in detail different types of construction crane types, their applications, advantages and disadvantages. So let's tune in. You must be familiar with the construction of Great Pyramid of Giza in Egypt which was completed way back in 2580 BC. The granite stones that were found in King's Chamber weigh 25 to 80 tons which were transported from Aswan more than 800 kilometers far. If such type of structure could have built in 21st century it would be very easy, just because of cranes. So, what is basically a crane in construction? Well, a crane is a hoist machine also termed as derrick or gantry it comprises of pulleys and wires and are operated hydraulically or electrically for lifting equipment. Now let's see different types of cranes. The first type is telescopic cranes. Telescopic crane has boom comprises of number of cylinders or tubes fitted one inside the other. When required these cylinders are extended by powering with the help of hydraulic mechanism. Telescopic cranes are of heavy cranes to transport and maneuver objects from one place to another and are used for small-scale construction projects, lifting boats and at ports. The next type is overhead gantry cranes. Gantry crane is a crane that is built overhead of a framework called gantry and is used to span on an object or workspace. These cranes are used in hydromechanical gate fixing, automobile shops for lifting engines and parts. The next on our list is mobile cranes. Well, from history we come to know that cranes were originally fixed to a position and before 1870 the crane was always expected to be a fixed element. Self-propelled models of mobile cranes are also being designed that need not to mount on any vehicle and have full-fledged capability of movement. Truck-mounted mobile cranes are used for bridge construction whether it is for launching of concrete girders or transporting bundles of steel bars or fixing of heavy-duty formwork these mobile cranes are nowadays very common in construction projects. The next is tower cranes. If you are opting a crane for a mega project then you can't miss tower crane from your list of options. The tower cranes are used to lift every sort of tool or equipment from as small as a generator to as large as a small crane. Tower crane basically have three major or basic parts. Its foundation or base, then a mast and at the top there is slewing unit. The base or foundation is actually a concrete slab in which the bolts for the tower cranes are embedded for fixing the tower crane. Sometimes the tower crane is also attached to the sides of the structure. Anyhow, the next part is called the mast. Mast is basically nothing but the tall tower you see between rotating slewing unit and the foundation. It consists of framed steel structures that are attached one after the other to achieve the required height as the construction progresses. At the top of the mast is the slewing unit that is equipped with a motor and a gear with the help of which it can rotate when required. On the slewing unit three parts are attached one is the operator's cab and ahead of that is the long horizontal jib which is also termed as working arm. The tower crane can reach to a heat of 8 meters with boom length of 70 meters. The lifting capacity can go up to 20 tons. That's enough about tower crane the next is about truck mounted crane. Truck mounted crane is actually a type of mobile crane. It is not self propelled rather it is fixed, 
mounted on the truck to reach different parts of the site when required. It can have a boom length between 14 to 22 meters and can carry load up to 20 tons. The booms of the truck mounted cranes are either stiff booms or knuckle boom that has a hinge at the mid for easy adjustment while reaching the length required. The next type is rough terrain types of cranes. Rough terrain crane is a self-propelled mobile crane that works by using hydraulic principles. As the name suggests this type of crane is best suited for rough surfaces and off-road applications. Rough terrain cranes are used in large-scale construction and infrastructure projects like bridges, power and chemical plants, refineries etc. Rough terrain cranes are powered by a single engine that powers both the undercarriage and the crane. The next type is loader crane. Loader crane can be called as a heavy-duty truck mounted crane. The loader cranes are used for loading the trucks, vehicles and heavy-duty panels or equipment to transport and shift to site. These are best suited for load travel and load operations. With the help of loader cranes you don't have to hire both truck and crane, it works for both of the jobs. The last type of crane on our list is floating cranes. Floating cranes are actually crane vessels which is a type of ship that can lift heavy loads. These crane vessels or floating cranes are a must to have in offshore construction projects. These floating cranes are also used while bridge building and port construction. The floating cranes have also been used to salvage sunken ships.